Okay. Emar, your turn, bitch! <laughs> You're watching. Another. Call of Duty! Gameplay commentary. Oh, guys, Pandemic Run bringing another Modern Warfare 3 gameplay commentary. And this is a really, really, really good gameplay. Um, so I guess yesterday me and a couple of friends decided, hey, we've been playing this game for a while, we still haven't done anything different. Let's do a challenge. So we challenged ourselves to try to get the enemy team to lose in domination 200 to nothing. We're still doing this because we still haven't done it yet. The closest we've gotten was 200 to 2. <clears throat> and it's in this game right here. King, I'm not blaming him. It's just that he kind of messed up on the B flag and they capped it. We all had a specific flag to go, and we're losing it right now. We all had a specific flag to go to. It was B and Bay at A. I think Corey and Pee Wee at C. And King Legend and Pyro at B. And guys, I'm so sorry. I'm sick still. That's crazy. So yeah, we had this challenge. We want to complete it. We're going to the winner. I know for a fact we will. Be just because we've. I mean, I've screwed up too. We could have gotten a 200 0 interchange, but I died at A and they, prevent they prevented my attack. So yeah, that was on me. But me and Bate had some clutch. Clutch, clutch moments at A. We had to. Uh, <laughs> it was hard holding down A. I'm not gonna lie. This is not the easiest challenge of all. There's only a couple maps you can actually do it on in this game. Because a lot of other, a lot of the maps spawn you right in front of the flag, um, so like the only maps that we were able to even get close on were interchange, terminal, and falling. Now for us to do on an interchange, we spot we would like to spot at uh, there the A side at security, but we didn't. So we I had to rush to B, and we had had. To have three good players rush to A to hold it down, and then two players at C. That's like the only way you could do it. You could not have two people go to A because usually their whole team will run to A. They don't want to get spawn trapped there and stuff. But yes, we had to do it that way, and that was the only way we could do it. And we did it, except the screw up on B. If we didn't have the screw up on B, this would be a flawless 200 to 0 nomination game. But it's a, it's whatever. We're gonna get it. This is the closest we've gotten so far, and I'm planning on uploading the 200 to zero today. We're going to get it today. That's how confident I am. And if we don't get it, I'm gonna be really, really sad, and then I'll just upload so 100 kill gameplay. But it's it, I'm just saying. Yes, yeah, so that's it. And for Fallen, you would have to spawn at C flag. Rush over to the B flag, prevent them from capping that. That's gonna be hard. And I see one person would have to go to A just to hold it down until we got back to A after the one person on C capped that flag. You know, there's a lot of challenges that we played on doing. Like, um, we're thinking of challenges. Like I said, I want to get a full party and have a flawless team deathmatch. In rank team deathmatch, we get 75 kills and they get nothing. And right here, there's a little host migration because half of the other team rage quits. This happens to us so many times already. We were on this map 67 to 0, and the other team rage quit. So we didn't get the 200 though, and I'm pretty sure we would have got it then. But whole team rage quit. Don't rage quit, guys. Just stick it out. Try to come back if you can come back. But yeah, I hate. What people rage with. We could have had the 200 0 already. If they're, we've been rage with on about three times. And I don't consider those wins. I consider those a rage with. Like, why would the other team back out? And that, that got me really mad because I knew we forgot the 200 0. But it's. It, uh, it happens. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, for interchange, that's like the easiest because nobody really spawns directly at a flag. We spawn on two opposite sides of the back diagonal from each other. So we would run to A and run to B. Two at A, two at B, two at C. And that's how you would do it. It's not camping because over the flag it says defend. So I don't want to hear none of that camping BS because we could be rushing around and stuff. We would have lost the game. We would have lost the flag. And you're bad, bro. Don't try to throw a C4 at me. <laughs> um. 
can't, we can't rush. You cannot do that. You have to stay at your flag with your teammate, or you will not do this challenge. You will not complete it at all. And if you have rushed around into this, then you are pretty good at this game. When I first started playing Call of Duty, I've used, I wanted my KD to be awesome. But like, I, after like a couple years of playing it, I have noticed KD really doesn't mean anything. And winning the game is pretty, that, that's the challenge. So that's what I've planned on doing for now on. I don't, I'm just gonna disregard KD. If I get a good gameplay, whatever. I'm trying to disregard KD. I just wanna win. It's all about the win now. <laughs> I play it on Black Ops still having like a 12.0 win loss. I'm really not going to care about my KD. Because I know I can get 24, 25, 30 kills in a row without dying. I know I can. You guys know I can. I've posted Slayer gameplays on here before. And if I really, really tried, I'm pretty sure I could hold a 12.0 win loss. That's like no losing, no rage quitting, full party all the time. And, yeah. <laughs> Right now, I think the score is 190 to 2 or something like that, or 193, and the, they keep rage quitting, and more people keep joining, so I consider this a legit gameplay. This is a pretty awesome gameplay. This is the closest we've gotten, and we're gonna get it today. Alright, well, the gameplay is coming to an end. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, don't leave hate. If you wanna see more, subscribe. I'm Panda Boy Rock, and I'm out. Peace.